Today, a group worked to help clear permanently abandoned encampments affected by winter storm flooding. Today's work specifically inside Camp Pollock, KCR Ray 3's Aaron Hept shows us the work they have ahead. Sacramento's winter storms were damaging. And as fear of flooding grew, many people sought shelter. Cal Expo was even converted into a safe place to stay. But as the water cleared, many people found new places to live. Leaving behind items they aren't coming back for. So this is what we call mop up. This is a sharp. All of that is abandoned camps over there and this. These encampments were abandoned during the winter flooding weeks ago. This footage from the River City Waterway Alliance kayaking down the American River bike trail. The water now gone. This is what's left behind. What we're talking about, about not being able to move forward because we're taking steps back all the time. Today, the team tackled Camp Pollock. It's a place they've done before, and they say they worked diligently beforehand with those who once lived here to ensure all of this is truly considered trash by the people who left it here. We removed about 700,000 pounds of trash and debris from, and debris is not organic debris. And I just feel like the public doesn't even know how bad it is. Bad enough, according to Dr. Roland Brady, to threaten the viability of the watersheds because he says a lot of this debris breaks down into microparticles and it looks tasty to animals. They look like food to the invertebrates and vertebrates that are in the watershed and they eat it and of course they can't digest it and because of that they can't pass it so they fill up with this stuff and die. A surplus of waste literally hauled out. The Alliance saying they hope more helping hands will join in to clear the land in an effort to keep as much as possible out of Sacramento's waterways. In Sacramento, Aaron Hecht, KCRA 3 News.